Gaurav and welcome to Asian Academy's YouTube channel. In this video, we'll be talking about the new recruitment opportunity, which has been released by uh, Rights. Uh, it's a very good PSU, infrastructure PSU, but it is specifically for apprenticeship positions. Now here, um, obviously, the students who want some kind of an internship, they can go for this kind of um, application. And also, uh, over here, students looking out for a certain kind of job opportunity to you know cover up their drop years if they are having a drop year right now they can choose this particular uh, application as well and apart from that online application will start from 17th of november 2025 and last date is 5th of december 2025 and over here obviously um, graduate and diploma apprenticeship positions here you the, the remuneration per month is obviously less 14,000 and 12,000 rupees and ITI pass 10,000 rupees is there and you need to have your engineering four years of degree and over here engineering diploma as well total number of vacancies which are released for engineering degree it is 110 and for diploma students it is 49 and for ITI positions it is 57 now based upon that um, you can also see that how many number of engineering vacancies are there uh, especially the graduate ones there are total of 110 vacancies in civil architecture electrical signal and telecom mechanical chemical and metallurgical and diploma as well civil electrical mechanical chemical and metallurgical total 49 vacancies are there and iti trade apprenticeship positions civil 5 mechanical 23 electrical 28 and others are one and total are 57 in this case now also uh, you can see the eligibility criteria as well here there will be no written test or interview right um, shortlisting will be done based on the merit list formed by the percentage marks which are obtained in your qualifying degree and on the basis of that they will be calling you uh, for the position so here there is no examination no interview and minimum qualifying marks are 60 which are required and on the basis of that they will be developing a merit and over here the essential qualification app, uh, applicable to the respective trades shall be from recognized university obviously following students shall not be eligible so candidates are waiting for essential qualification result uh, before the cutoff date or on the cutoff date candidates not completed 18 years of age uh, candidates who have undergone apprenticeship training earlier also in some other um, organization candidates who have undergone training or has job experience for a period of one year or after attainment of essential qualification or more after the attainment of degree and candidates completing essential qualification of engineering non-engineering or diploma that means final semester result date prior to 17th of november 2020 right that is five years so you are not applicable in this particular case you there are five conditions which i have mentioned and on the basis of that you can just choose to apply for it or not and apart from that how to apply you can see nats.education.gov.in uh, you can go on this portal first register is oh, register over here and then apprenticeship india.gov.in right once registered on NATS or NAPS, you can go to the official website and you can type in the registration number and uh, apply at rights official website. And before applying, you need to have your all the essential documentation, the qualification degree, personal credentials, caste certificates and everything uh, with you. Uh, and then obviously go for applying, right? After applying on the respective portal, you can go to the official website and apply and these are the things which are required your identity proof caste certificate date of birth proof as well as your essential qualifications so that date of birth proof is your matriculation certificate Aadhaar card etc and obc ncl category also the latest caste certificate which is required as per government of india norms also candidates shall ensure that only valid or required documents as mentioned above are submitted through rights application form latest by 5 
of December 2025, right? Otherwise, your application will be left out. And apart from that selection process, as told you, after the receipt of your online application, which is completed, uh, the merit of list shall be prepared based on the eligibility or sex selection criteria, which, is, which was mentioned above. And it will be available on the official website of rights. And then you can carry forward with your job profile once you get the job letter. And there are some general instructions as well for the physically handicapped and caste certificate students as well. Now, this is uh, not important. So this much is there in this relevant notification over here. So it's a good opportunity, especially for those students who have taken a drop year and they are looking out for some job opportunity or they are preparing for some competitive examination and parallelly you need to get into some, you know, some work experience or on site you need some kind of an experience. It's a good opportunity, right? Parallelly keep on preparing for your competitive examinations and parallelly go for this apprenticeship. Right. Apply for such apprenticeship jobs in PSUs. It's a good opportunity and they see something is better than nothing, right? Always keep this in mind. Do like this video, subscribe to our channel, share it with your friends if you think it would be helpful for them. And thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.